It's fifty dollars asterisk. Tomer, you, you use that excuse like every other week now as you beat us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I actually am more scared of you when you have a budget deck when you play a non-budget deck. Dang it. <laughs> yeah. Dang it, they figured me out. This video is brought to you by Card Kingdom. Head on over to cardkingdom.com to get your Magic the Gathering products, including the brand new Zendikar Rising cards today. Hey everyone, and welcome back to Commander Clash. We've been doing a highlight celebration of the latest set, Zendikar Rising, and we showed off, you know, party week and all that stuff. Now we're going to jump into the big stuff. The stuff that everybody's been waiting for. It's been, it's been built up all this time, years and years of waiting, but finally we get the bowl we've all been waiting for. That's right. It's Omnath Bowl. There are four Omnath versions all entering the battlefield this week. Only one will survive. So, Seth, which Omnath did you choose for this week? So, I have the Omnath from our last return to Zendikar. Omnath, Locust of Rage, the biggest of all the Omnaths. Uh, and it's a, it's a landfall commander. And this one, it's probably not like super surprising to people. I think it's like one of the more popular gruel commanders that there is. Basically, lands come into play. You get five fives. When your elementals die, you deal damage to stuff. The thing I'm excited, well, there's two things I'm excited about for this deck, but I'm only going to tell you about one of them. One of them is we got a bunch of sweet new landfall stuff in our new Zendikar Rising. So I get to try out like Scoot Swarms, uh, Morog, uh, the new extra combat step thing. So uh, there's some really cool new cards that I'm excited to play in the deck. It is, in many ways, a traditional Omnath deck where I'm looking to make a lot of land drops, I'm looking to ramp, I'm looking to make a bunch of elementals, but there's a bit of a twist with something that I really want to pull off, but I'm not going to tell you about it. We'll see. We'll see if I draw. It's <laughs> it's only a couple of cards. It's not like a game-winning combo or anything. It might be a moto-winning combo uh, if it actually <laughs> happens. We'll see. I get a feeling there might be some moto crashes if I pull it off, but yeah, so there is a surprise. We'll see if I draw it, though, so I, I'm excited. I think this deck's going to be super fun. How many stuff are you gonna put on the stack at once, Seth? That's the question. Oh boy, it might it might be a lot. If things go to plan, it's gonna be a lot. <laughs> okay, that that sounds that sounds tantalizing. I I expect Moto to crash, so that's gonna be called shot right now for this episode. <laughs> All right, next up we got Krim. What Omnath are you running? Uh, I'm playing the Teamer one. So this one is going to be all about how many elementals you can get on board. Uh, this, you know, which actually isn't hard considering that I think there's just like naturally a ton of elementals you want to play anyways when it comes to Omnath. Um, so I, I'm going to go with, uh, with like that. I, th there's, there's, there's a ton of elementals in here. I'm not going to tell you everything in here, but I will tell you that we've got a decent amount of new cards. Like Seth had also said, like Zendikar Rising really brought a lot of, uh, Landfall stuff for the deck and some sweet elementals to try with along the way. Um, and, uh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah, the landfall is definitely a strong theme in Zendikar Rising. And it seems like elementals are just always tied to lands as, as just like a general rule. So it seems like it works really well. It's going to tie in really well. And I haven't seen a lot of teamer on math lists, honestly. I've seen the Guru one a bunch. Um, I've played the four color a bunch, and I've seen the green color a bunch, but not Teamer. So this is going to be interesting to see Elementals uh, and what they can do. Yeah, and, and you know, there. The, let's just say that maybe sometimes there's just an alliance that you have to make that you don't <laughs> like, and uh, I might, I might, I might, oh, I might be playing it. <laughs> uh, okay, <laughs> interesting. All right, uh, and then moving on, we got Richard. What? On that, are you running? All right, Tomer, you butchered the intro. We should have went from ascending order of colors <laughs> or release Ooh. date or something. Uh, I have mono Why would you put that hurt to the viewers? <laughs> oh, oh, it's so, so true. Oh, now that bothers me. I have me. one color. <laughs> I only have one color. I hope someone brought the board wipes because I don't have elementals. All I do is make lots of mana. Uh, I will have a singular big Omnath. But I don't know how I'm going to deal with 5-5s five and landfall triggers and things like that. Uh, but I'm going to make lots of mana. And then I'm going to attempt to spend my mana. And I'm going to hope someone else 
polices the board <laughs> while uh. I do this and everyone leaves me alone because I'm model green and I can't really kill anything. So, so yeah, I, I have original Omnath. Uh, mana, green mana doesn't empty my mana pool uh, at the end of steps and phases so I can pile it up and then hopefully do something explosive. He says, hopefully the rest of the board deals with situations as he wins the game, <laughs> like he always does. Yet again. Yet again. <laughs> every time. Editor, put up the stats. I haven't won anything this season. Someone put up the stats. <laughs> I dispute that. But anyway, hello, this is Tomer. I am running the four-color Omnath. I don't know what, like, is there a term for red green white blue omnath like is that is that it's is it not black is it fork i don't know it's on math standard standard all star standard standard for, so, standard just so, standard just call it standard, standard. so i have a standard omnath. i haven't standard played omnath. i haven't played standard since like original innistrad block uh go go heartless summoning deck um <laughs> so i don't know anything about omnath in terms of standard but what I do know is it's actually pretty decent in Commander. It looks like it's mm, made for Commander. Yeah. Uh, I don't know mm. about other formats, but it, it's clearly made for Commander, and it's an all-star there. Uh, it draws a card when it enters the battlefield, which is good. Uh, it has three <laughs> different landfall triggers. This is, like, great. Uh, I don't know if it can make it in Standard, because this is yeah, clearly a Commander card. It's just card. too hard to cast yeah. with four colors. Four colors? Uh, and I mean, it's so slow, right? Like, you can only cast it on turn four. Yeah, that's yeah, insane. It's... Um, but it's good. In, it's good enough in in commander, I will say. Um, so I I did a challenge for myself. I know uh, people were uh, kind of not happy with the warrior tribal deck that I did, and I'm not sure what the response is going to be for the uh, sh the budget Ashaya I did. But I'm going to assume because it did well in one game, people are not going to like me. So I went, I went all out with the budget on the budget commander side. This is fifty dollar asterisk on math. Uh, the asterisk is because uh, I'm not counting the commander. If you count the commander, it's seventy two dollars. Uh, but you know, clickbait and all. So I'm gonna go for that. <laughs> it's fifty dollar on math asterisk. Click it. Uh, if it's heavily played cards and it's like $20. Um, but yeah, it's really good even on a budget. Like it's, it's, it has a lot of solid power. Uh, I'm missing, you know, some of the, the awesome like staples, but there are good equivalents that are dirt cheap that are going to do a good enough job. So I'm excited to see if, if this budget Omnath can Omnath all the other Omnaths, you know? Om nom nom nom. Om nom nom nom. Yes. nom. Only one, only one Omnath will eat today, and the rest will be the eaten. There will be the yes. eater and the eaten, I think. You have all the colors. <laughs> I have all the colors. Yeah. All the colors. You have all the answers. I'm sure you had an issue with probably lit, like cut, keeping your deck at only 100 cards. No, 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 four no, colors. no, 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 no. I had to cut some cards like Oracle will die and then make it. You know, no, no, no. Let's, look, let's get into the game. You'll see what cards I'm running. All right. So with the deck intros out of the way, let's hop into the game. I did actually play this. I played this deck. Actually, if people are interested in seeing uh, more of this specific deck, I ran an earlier version of it uh, on stream that's going to be on the YouTube channel and uh, a bridge gameplay. Yes, a bridge gameplay as well that I did on it. So if you want to see more on that, you can check those out while we wait for uh, Krim to enter the game. Oh, okay. the ghost of worst smiles upon me. <sighs> I go first. All is right with the world. Ah, okay. here we go. Tomer's gonna dunk us game one, then we're gonna dunk him, <laughs> and then it's gonna be great. Oh, this is actually, this is actually, okay. All right, chat. Don't, okay. I will explain. Chat. <laughs> Not chat, viewers. All right, I, I was, I'm doing the streamer life now, you know? Like, I have to, I, I believe in the chat. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep this. Don't, don't. All right. I'm, Yours? I'm gonna quiet. I'm gonna keep this. So we so we gotta kill Tomer then? No, what? I got a one lander. <laughs> to, why me? Uh, <laughs> why not you, Tomer? Do? Why not you? To I'll also keep this <laughs> in concern oh. for something. Oh, this hand is not good. I'm just keeping a meme card. Oh. <laughs> You're oh, a mono still. green deck, Richard. How do you have that hand? I have all like eight drops. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Hold on. Wait, wait, hey wait, Richard. 
How mad would you be if hypothetically I had a card that destroyed all forests? Oh my um, god. <laughs> what? <laughs> you gotta be kidding. Uh, <laughs> pass? <laughs> So we kill Krim uh, first. Oh, I'm just okay. I, don't, I don't know. I don't have it. All right, it. all right. We can we can, we can we can restart if you went down how, to. How about you? How about you play a card that makes us all draw cards and play additional land drops? <laughs> uh, <laughs> is your six good, Richard? Good enough? Uh, I think it's good enough. Like you get to play magic? Okay. <laughs> I just I just need like a single land and we're good. <laughs> okay. All right. We it's will fine. we will it's go fine. for it. My hand is actually pretty crummy too, and I also need a land. Yeah, my hand's actually not very good either. It's my okay, hands but... my hand's pretty crummy. <laughs> <laughs> Kill Krim first. Uh, <laughs> I mean, look at it this way. When Krim drops his mass land destruction, I won't have any lands from destroy. Because <laughs> my deck has more land draws. I see a lot of forests. I see a lot of forests. I like it. Yeah, but who has I the can't believe forest. you bet a game just like this. <laughs> oh no no no! I I just if I'm playing I, I, like I now I just expect to hate out green every day that passes with standard. I just hate green more. <laughs> I mean, I I think my forest is winning so far. So I, we'll so, see. Oh, definitely beating Richard's forest too. Crap, I was actually, need a good forest. I was actually upgrading my uh, my personal decks of Zendikar Rising cards, and I decided to cut down my my Gargos deck has you know increased in price as as time goes by. I lowered it back down to fifty, which made me have to do some sad cuts, like cutting out Veil of Summer. But I'm keeping it in my sideboard just in case we ever play Krim. And then I'll bring it back okay. in for you. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. You know, Veil of Summer is like fifteen dollars or something like that. It's like right eight. Now? Yeah. What? Yeah. It's a lot. It's like it, it's it's like a lot of dollar dues now. Or like <laughs> it that. is a lot. It is. It is like a a modern staple, pretty much at this point. Uh, if only it were good. Is it uncommon? Like, yeah. Is it, it is. Weird? Yeah. Uh, uncommon. I have to hit any land. <laughs> Oh, you're in my position. I, <laughs> I kept a two oh. lander, and I'm like, I need to hit one land, and this hand will be absolutely great. Don't you worry about Please it. Please have no interaction. Whoa! <laughs> Richard's what got all the ram. Whoa! You're, I mean, you're really hoping for just, zero board wipes this game. I I drew I, I drew my second forest. Okay. okay so that I locked my way into it. Yeah. I need to Can hit we get a, any land. Oh, I was I was waiting for the counterbalance, Krim. This would, would no. have been the perfect <laughs> counterbalance turn. <laughs> any land. Any land. No! Oh, it's, I didn't it's hit it's a land. Control has I'm blue red that. splashing control. Like That's splashing not green. Good. Uh oh. Is this the what discard the hand size part of the game? Well, I it's mean, like Kadama's yeah. Reach or Cultivate or something. I mean, I do have that equivalent. Yes, I have two ramp cards. All right, so goodbye, Didn't, Maria Shepard. Do you remember? Do you remember, Tomer? Uh, do you remember like a big rant you did one time about how you should play two mana ramp instead of three mana ramp? Yes. Ooh, how do you feel about how do you feel about that? <laughs> how How do you feel about that statement at the moment? <laughs> I, I'm writing all the two mana land ramp that I have available to me. Oh wait. So all your lands count as forests. Or no, they, they, they tap. Never mind. I'm so scared. They, tap. <laughs> uh, they actually do count as forests because uh, I, I, got, I got blown out in Modern the other day by someone uh, playing Boil. Because oh, yeah, yeah. Off, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So you play the dry and they're just like, yeah, Boil you. And you're like, oh, my God, come on now. <laughs> I have like 42 lands in the deck, please. This. So Richard has six mana. Correction, yeah. sorry. Richard has a silly amount of mana. He has a silly amount of mana. I I'm mean, in very some afraid. Sense, <laughs> in some sense, we're all ramp decks. Maybe Krim less so, but even, like, Krim is probably somewhat of a ramp oh, deck. Oh, okay. That breaks the house rule. Wait, what? This breaks Three the visits is like $200. Yeah, it's like a oh. bear. <laughs> Richard, I was so proud that it was a far seek. I'm like, wait, oh, does this not work? Rich, it's two hundred and eight dollars. <laughs> you have the shame score. Just it's wait, fine. just wait until I draw my wheel of fortune. <laughs> it's fine. It's in nature's lore. Yeah, yeah, it's just in nature's lore. Wait, is nature's lore expensive? This is what this is what happens when you break the rules, Richard. Okay, I'll take four life. <laughs> <laughs> That's not, that's, not, that's not bad. You're just you're just saying that you should break the rules more often. <laughs> no! You're rewarded. 
<laughs> Every time you break the rules, you gain life. Also, no. why would you not blow up the dryad? I, because he broke the, the rules! It's three? Oh, because it's a portal card. Huh. Yeah, yeah. I, I actually don't look at price. I would have destroyed the dryad. Don't dual lands and soul ring in my deck, and that's it. I would have destroyed the dryad, but I had to send a message. You just wanted to not discard the hand size. That's I, not I, a I mean, I, I could have still not discarded the hand oh. size. And I'm going to hit my land. I have like 43 of them in my deck. No! What the? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Oh, uh, look at Tomer it? over here. How many lands do you play? Like 30 or something like oh that, right? That, can that stick? Can I we have, make that stick? Can we make that I stick? 30, Tomer? Yeah. I have 36 regular lands, and then I have like six <laughs> or seven moto lands, and I can't. It Just one more. I just. Oh my god. All right. Well. <laughs> Uh, it's so hard no for me to feel play. bad for <laughs> for the new Omnath. You, you, you <laughs> yeah, you I, a, I do not feel pity for the <laughs> Wait, Wait, Amaria Shepherd. Yeah, it's landfall. Is Are there two expensive? mono green decks? I don't understand here. What is, is it expensive? <laughs> no, it's a oh, dollar. Yeah. Tober doesn't even have any colors. He, yeah, he's yeah. a four color deck. <laughs> I. Wow. He is. You can just play all the lands you want now. So. This is really bad. Oh, look at that. <laughs> all right, let me know when it's my turn. <laughs> There's a gamble. Oh, oh! if he had the new Omnath, this would be crazy. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I got I to gotta keep up with Richard. Oh. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> but you have like a real... Oh, my God. <laughs> Uh, over. The game. I, he has a gamble on top too. Should Should I attack Tomer? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> or Punish Richard. Him for, or Punish Richard him for not having this, the third land. This is. Wait, this you is didn't have the second land. You were just were is, lucky. You were just luckier I, I, than me. I had a Finhorn Elves though. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Plays. And I balled the six already. <laughs> I, I the, used two more Mulligans. Like, than you. The meme card <laughs> is. I had to keep the meme card. The chat would understand. What? This is a meme card that's worth not playing the game for. <laughs> it was, it's worth it. Chat. Not chat. Viewers. Viewers. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> uh, viewers are just I do that sometimes, too. Chat. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't make up the rules. So, so Seth's about to get a gamble. Uh -huh. uh, I might. I might get a gamble. Richard's yeah. about to play his commander and go off, though. I, I don't have many cards in hand. That's the concern. You have a oh elemental card. God. Every land is like a card, right? <laughs> he has so oh. much mana. Commander damage. No! Oh my gosh. It's Voltron. Richard has more mana than I do. <laughs> By far. Yeah. I have no lands though. I have something sick. Next turn I'll have something. <laughs> Everyone's just going to be out of cards but have a million mana. <laughs> Except, I'm Except the big play. Tober has the exact opposite. Here. Tomer, yeah. Tomer's, Tomer's on the Krim technique. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I, can't, I, I need, can't I need a wheel of fortune right no now. I have no lands to blow up, right? <laughs> oh. That's level play. I'm so far behind. Holy moly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, me and Richard both have like 20 mana. You have two, <laughs> two forests. <laughs> I want and you're four color. It's hilarious because you're a four color deck too, and somehow you have two basic forests as your lands. <laughs> <laughs> is it because you played all the MDFCs? Okay, I'm counting right now. How many? You have are to you, cut something to put all okay, the MDFCs one, in. Are you Are you sure you don't two, accidentally have an MDFC in hand three. and you're just not realizing it? That would make me. So I've sad. done that. I've done that a few times. Oh, Chat would not be pleased about that. <laughs> Four. I've definitely mulliganed to hand. Darn it! I only have Five. a one lander. <laughs> I've done. I've done the same thing. <sighs> Okay, I have five MTFCs and 36 lands, so that's 41 lands in the deck. Oh my god, I didn't it yet! What? <laughs> and I have two mana ramp. I have a bunch of two mana ramp in my hand. I even I even have land cyclers that cost two mana. It's not in my hand, not in my hand. I, I'm good. In your hand. Yeah, 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 it's not in my hand. It's not in my hand. Yeah, yeah. It's not in my hand. Man. Do you have a card with basic land cycling that you're not using? Yeah, I wish. I have two basic land cyclers in my deck as well. So 51 lands, two basic land cyclers, a bunch of two and one mana ramp, and I'm just getting just getting dunked on this week. All right, I mean, so I, didn't, I didn't attack you. Infinite turn here. So. All right. 
I'm, I'm not going to cast this anytime soon, but this card is actually just garbage right now for me. Actually, wait, no, it's a blocker if I ever get to that. Okay. <laughs> Goodbye, Sun Titan. <laughs> You're not going to discard your, your, your meme Titan card? A blocker. I'm not discard. The meme card will stay oh, until I Oh, he got die. a one in Foothills, too. Oh, oh, that's a great Aurora. <laughs> oh, oh, you're trying to make a bunch of tokens in Great Aurora, aren't you? Uh, perhaps. That it's is, like that Boundless is a Realms, a bunch of tokens, Great Aurora. Uh, classic, a... classic Seth. So now you make like 30 power of creatures and draw like eight cards? Is this. Oh, I guess we could. Have... Like if you, if you had held that Nature's Claim. <laughs> maybe this <laughs> elemental. I had to send a message, <laughs> Richard. Maybe if you didn't cheat. You know, break the sacred rules of our house, then oh, maybe boy. this could have been avoided. And he's probably gonna like Valakut or something. Scapeshift Valakut or Dryad. Oh, he, no. he doesn't have that much mana. Omnath costs like a, a billion. Omnath is really expensive. Yeah. Oh, a tireless tracker? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the value that's gonna happen. I can't even run tireless tracker in my deck. That's a six dollar card. Unfortunately it's it's getting shuffled away. Oh no! Oh, oh look, <laughs> that that's oh, it. Look. That's the game right there. Can someone uh, do something this turn? Literally. <laughs> oh, uh, I'll tap my two forests and just uh, wipe Seth's board. Uh, oh, and harmonize. Let's do this. Wait, did you shuffle away the escape shift? No, no I drew, drew that. It. Oh, that's not good. That means escape shift oh. good. This is gonna be a quick game. Yeah, you're gonna be bored by we're gonna get how like, many triggers is that with Dryad? That's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh. oh, oh, he discarded the Great Aurora. Concede. That's a bummer. <laughs> Good. Oh, there's an anger now. Okay. He still has All escape right, shift though. The Great Aurora wouldn't kill us outright. The escape, sh the escape shift will. Do you think he can escape shift into Valakut? <laughs> oh, it's just, like, Green Warden. Oh, that's not good. Okay, that's that's all I got. That's it. That's it. Nothing. It? Okay. <laughs> nothing to be concerned okay. about. Uh, I won't even attack this turn. That's just the kind of kind of guy I am. <laughs> wow, so generous, <laughs> so generous over here. <laughs> Can you kill me last? <laughs> are are we going for second already? It's only yeah, only yeah. turn five. Are we already to the I'm playing for second part? You know of you the don't game? get any points for second, right, Krim? Like <laughs> I I do mentally. Oh. That's all I care about. <laughs> uh, <laughs> all right, kill him first. I want to break him mentally. <laughs> I mean, that's already oh. happened. Have you seen the like everyone's board? <laughs> oh yeah, my board's pretty scary. I know, especially yours. <laughs> Mine especially. Richard just, could have a pretty good turn. I just wanted to play like, my meme card. <laughs> I, the viewers are already pretty good terms, but I have no cards. Three mana, but I, I have three different three mana ramp spells <laughs> in my hand. All right. So Richard has cast all of his stuff. Yeah. He's oh, hell oh boy. He's heck bent. Well, hell bent. Sasaya. Oh, you're you're a bit away from seven lands in hand at the moment. <laughs> yeah, uh, <laughs> just uh, just a smidge. Uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> I'll take a bit. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> Whoa, okay. that that's a big that's a big bomb now. Uh, okay, so wait, what do I? Okay, yeah. All right, I got nothing. I'm done. <laughs> I played all my cards. <laughs> Good game. Good game. <laughs> <laughs> Seth, you can kill I just want to hit one of my 51 lands, please. <laughs> um. Oh. Uh. I do need that. That would be nice. Uh, is it a Wheel of Fortune? Oh, please, no. I can do cool things next turn. Don't let him escape shift. Or uh, just destroy have a Cyclonic Rift. Do it. Uh, do yeah. it. Oh, destroy all fours. I'm down. Go, do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, no. We're, we're, not, we're not doing that. What do Let's I have do to it. lose? <laughs> you, only, you, you have two fours. You're good. <laughs> actually, Seth would be okay because he actually has, he'll have four mana still. Yeah. Oh, wait, all my lands are for us because of Dryad. Oh, oh that'd be hilarious. <laughs> yeah, that would, that would get him. That would get him good. Why am I rooting uh, for force destruction? Oh my god. <laughs> Krill has turned into a dark side. It's just like mass land destruction every week now. Especially, no. especially mass forest destruction on Omnath week. That's I, I think that's Richard, Richard's a bad influence. That is influence. Tomer level. I bet you Richard somehow has forest destruction Ooh. too. 
He's gonna like animate our lanes and destroy them. I'll give it haste. Well, that's not that's not uh, that's not an answer to this <laughs> haste. haste <laughs> that's not an answer to this at all. <laughs> all uh, you need is two mana, and you bounce the Omnath in response to Scape Shift, and we're good. Oh, okay, all right. Send a message. Send hit Tomer. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I hit Tomer on the way out. You win it. When you attack? No, you don't get anything. Okay, I found one of my lands. Ooh. Good job, Tomer. You have three mana. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh, right, wow. How's that MDFC working out for you? <laughs> give, me, uh, give me three more turns, and I might have an answer. We will not be here for another turn. <laughs> like, just trust. Just trust. All right. We, we need the the fabled ether eyes here. But Seth will have so many cards in hand, though. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure what I'm... Krim is leaving mana up, which makes me a little nervous. It's aether eyes. <laughs> just yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you might as, you might as well just pass your turn, Seth. How do, we, how do we navigate this turn? You just pass. Hmm. <laughs> you start you with have scape shift? six cards. I think pass is wrong. <laughs> It's bad that he has multiple things to do. Just have Veil of... Just, just skate shift with Veil of Summer up. How do you lose? <laughs> Everyone brings Veil of Summer just for Krim. I, I gotta, Actually, I gotta do a little a honestly, little bit of count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hmm. 12, 13, 14, 15, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Ooh, do we do the thing that makes us most likely to win or is most fun? You, yes. you, if you can win, go for the win, right? Are you going to yes. counter a- anything I do, Cram? <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, no, <laughs> maybe. That's not mana drain mana. Uh, yeah, it's not mana drain same. mana. You're fine. <laughs> <laughs> we, we all know he mana only is not in the mana budget. There's no way he'd play it. Answers. How about this? What? That does, how does that win the game? game? You can just cycle his whole deck now. That doesn't win the game, but it does draw me a lot of cards. But there you go. You could have won the game with Scape Shift. I mean, I could still actually escape win shift. the game with Scape Shift, right? Uh, so Krim. Yeah. Are you gonna counter my stuff? <laughs> I mean, probably not. Maybe I don't know. It depends. <laughs> mm, Why? Okay. Did you offer him second place? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Did you did you offer him? <laughs> if you if you kill me last, we can discuss. <laughs> I think we just kill Rada. Okay. <laughs> And then Got draw him. a few cards. Oh, this lets him kill everything because he has a sack outlet now. Yeah, oh, so dead. Uh, well, I mean, he only I, I has. Th- I thought it was has, just the card draw. He doesn't have that many elementals on the battlefield. Yeah, One. but he has a scape shift in hand. But yeah, if, he's, if he <laughs> resolves the scape shift, he wins. <gasps> Seth cast that wheel. <laughs> yeah, cast. You know what's fun? Casting a wheel. What is you this could, wheel of fortune, give, fortune, man? You could give Tomer <laughs> some What lands. is this? Why? Why wouldn't I have Wheel of Fortune? Because it's of out of the point. budget. Think, think of all the lands you could play. Why would Wheel you Fortune. have Wheel of Fortune? It's a two hundred and ten dollar. Why card. are you killing my things? And why didn't I respond? <laughs> <laughs> Do the house rules mean nothing to everyone <laughs> when it comes oh. to Wheel whoa, of whoa, Fortune? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yes. Don't 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 gr- don't lump me in with that. Oh I yeah. Have not oh yeah. Okay. Mana drain. Added- All right. Hey, mana hey, drain. I didn't. I didn't have mana drain the last two games. Uh, yes, one of this because one of the decks was also green and white. But uh, the one before that, I didn't have it. All right. We're gonna need. We're gonna have to have a sit down intervention here. And and on top of that, look look oh, at this. I have played nothing wanted. out of budget. All I have right, played nothing out of budget. That's exactly All what right. we we're hoping for. <laughs> Kill us so we can go finish to it. <laughs> what are you doing? He just Never. wants to draw cards, that's all he wants to do. Finish it, he's just gonna actually deck himself. So I'm a greater good by not counting. <laughs> Seth just wants to play some solitaire, all right? Give him don't, some don't fun. Worry. It's, don't worry, it's more don't worry. Uh, how about a how about a lotus cobra? Oh, good, yay! I mean, does it really matter? <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> Look at all the stuff he has on board, that's I think the least of our worries. Uh, all right, so we'll play this, Richard. You can put a land into play if you'd like. Thank you. I <laughs> no problem. Your kind gesture. I'm utilizing that F6 key. Auto yield. I can mean, the question. The question is mostly: Does Krim have a counter? I mean, there's only one way to find out. 
So I've never encountered any of the crazy. It, but it doesn't, it doesn't seven matter. Cards left. It doesn't matter like, if he counters it. it. Really you still matter. have a winning board state. So you might yeah, as well just do it. Next to Nahiri's lithoforming again. Okay, okay. Although if he counters the lithoforming, it's hilarious. <laughs> No, no, no. I, 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 just, I, sca- I, arcane denial, wins. the Lotus Cobra. Pass. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm working up towards something. Okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's going to be worth it in the end, I hope. No. <laughs> <laughs> if you just, like, kill Krim and then cast Scape Shift, and then there's no blue mana to worry about? I guess I could. Oh, okay, it's Valakit Awakening. That might be mm, all of my cards. Yeah, Valakid Awakening is really good. Uh, I guess we play more lands. Make more elementals. How many lands have you played this turn? Sorry. <laughs> I think this is my last one with what I got now. Actually, no, wait. I played... Yeah, I think this <clears throat> is my last one for now. I think. Very good. Very good. <laughs> All right, so we add a bunch Very of mana. Cool. Yeah, can you I can't play, play any more lands. You can't play the Mim at the top of your library, right? Because it's a uh, it's a L- creature, no. not not a land when it's on top. When it's under that the is yeah, that is correct. Unless, of course, Tomer just I mean, uh, Seth just draws it. Hmm. Um. Well, let's flow all of our mana. Well, you oh, can only good. play three, two additional lands per turn, right? Yeah, currently. Unfortunately. Uh Aww, unfortunately. All right. <laughs> all right, Krim, it's I think it's the moment of uh the moment of truth. Oh my god, you don't have it? No. <gasps> oh, okay. This is gonna be really <laughs> cool. Then. All the lands I could play. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be this is gonna be even cooler than I hoped, as long as I don't deck myself, which is the actual possibility. <laughs> Should okay, I So now he gets like infinite mana. Gets infinite Omnath things. Is that just not enough to kill? Well, he just, he just gets Valakut a bunch of weird. triggers, and then he has a huge army of elementals that all have haste thanks to anger. As long as he, Wait, yeah. anger's in the yeah. yard? Oh, anger's in the yard. Oh, yeah, yeah, anger's yeah. in the yard. So he just I mean, has yeah. a... He can actually... He has, the, he has, like, multiple scape shifts in hand, too. Right? Yeah, he has, like, so he has he like 10 lightning bolts, times. 10 additional 5-5 five, five elemental creatures that all have haste. You attack with everything, and then you sacrifice them to greater good just to, to rub it in. Oh, so so, oh yeah! Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah! It's alive. Oh yeah! It's way too early. There's no way Mortal will crash. Oh yeah! I, I'm <laughs> actually like, uh, I don't really want to kill you though. Please, no, okay, kill, just kill him. Just <laughs> kill me, so I can go on to game number two. Yes! Is that is that the yes. responsible thing to do? Yes. But I have a card in hand that I really want to resolve. I'll concede. Okay, I'm gonna let me. I'm gonna resolve one more card uh, after this is done, and then we're just gonna concede in response to this <laughs> right now. <laughs> it's it could actually help you. It's a it's a friendly card. In response. Oh no, I got to draw. I'm conceding. <laughs> Alright, hang on, I'll just auto yield to this. Let me cast one more card and then and then uh and then I'll kill you or we can concede. Because it. it might it might end with a moto win. Can you can you kill me last? I don't know what happens if I get to resolve this card. <laughs> I think you do get to resolve it. Effect, right? uh, yeah, I, I actually have no idea what's gonna happen if I do this. What turn is this? Turn six? Okay, cool. You should play the random card where we like just redistribute all the permanents. <laughs> Scramble verse? I love that card. <laughs> oh, I'm kind of drawing cards that I would rather you have. You would love deck. that card. That's awkward. Card is hilariously fun. I mean, I you also so know much. I enjoy chaos decks. Ah, uh, uh, I hate chaos decks so much. I, I mean, I, I think chaos decks are amazing. Kind of unfortunate in, in like, you know, the times that we're in because you know like we're playing through spell table mostly but <laughs> maybe maybe you don't play scramble verse in a in a over spa- like spell table and stuff like that that would be that's the only the only thing worse than playing scramble verse is playing scramble verse on spell table yeah <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I th- I think I lied. I actually have to cast two spells, but but bear Save with me. I promise him. it's ending quickly. Conceding. I promise. I promise it's almost over. The pain is almost over, and I might not even win because of this. I might be making myself lose. Really. So okay, we do this. Then we just cast. Uh, we cast this. Just I only have to do this because there's a couple cards that I need to put. Oh my I, gosh! I need to put back in my <laughs> library because. Uh, it'll make sense. It'll make sense in a minute. 
Okay. Like Valakut. I don't care about Valakut. <laughs> That's not part of my plan. All right, so we're just gonna put a put a few cards back in. He didn't even find Valakut. No the big deal. Shift. He just. It's in his. It's in his hand. He drew it. Then, uh, then we just cast this real quick to shuffle those cards back in, so they're not at the bottom <laughs> of my library. I promise. I promise. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're hey, getting there. Nice three visits there, Seth. <laughs> <laughs> That one's that's that's nature. Story. I have that's I have a digital one. altar, guys. It's fine. <laughs> all right, and all right. The moment it's all been building up towards. Okay. The form? No. It's like I cast harmonize. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. I cast all right. Tracker, this is what it's all been clue. about. Equal. Oh. All right. I mean, you still you still gonna win. Let's you see what happens. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Wait, Wait, look how many permanents you have. I have three permanents. <laughs> <laughs> this this actually just like made the game like last way longer. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna. I think Moto's gonna win here. No, I, I think it's fine. Oh, oh wait, who had the Avenger of Zendikar? Chris. Me. Oh, okay. I have an Avenger of Zendikar oh. also. Oh, oh my god! And I have my. your I have your commander. Oh my god! This stack. There's, There's no way Moto uh, survives this. To it. There is a scroll to it. You can There's see no way. Wait, who has my Phylath? Hmm? That's my Phylath. You only get oh. your own cards. I don't even... How, did, how does the stack even resolve? Uh, that's a hey, good question. Your, your, your board state, you, you somehow lost the lander. Don't worry. No! Oh, boy, I can't. Oh, you I gotta. Can't. Someone has to stack their triggers first. You guys have to stack your triggers first. I can't. I'm clicking on the spore mount triggers. I can't add them to the yeah. stack. Oh, and I, I got my scoot swarm too. If this resolves, it'll be so spectacular. What that, the... Yes, that's the word. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I stack something. It let me stack a thing. Okay. <laughs> We're doing it. Sort of. Oh. Okay. If you wanna, if you wanna concede, we can. I guess it's gonna take forever to stack all these. This will take like twenty minutes. Yeah, it's gonna it's going very, very slowly. Well, I did what I wanted to do, which was resolve warp world and do this. We the triggers will be very interesting if we let them resolve, but it's gonna take forever. <laughs> Richard's like, I'm out of here. Richard's done. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, you, all right. you guys you guys can resolve it. Like, I had maybe my, one person stay and then Seth can actually resolve all his triggers. I had my it. I had my fun. <laughs> we out. <laughs> Moto Moto hasn't actually crashed yet, surprisingly. Well, it hasn't it's, let me concede. I clicked concede. Oh, there we go. It's not working <laughs> well, but it's cool. All right, all right. Now that that I can get second. All right, cool. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Got us. All right, on to game two. All right, that was close, 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 close. Are game, you going to keep a two lander again, Tober? Uh, yes. <laughs> That was, was the meme card worth it? I had two lands and grow from the ashes in my hand, so I had to hit any third land i had 51 in my hand or 51 in my deck and i had two land cyclers and i had multiple one and two ramp sources and i had a great meme card there's no way i would shuffle it away i don't know viewers can say whatever they want at this point but i know i'm right oh i lost a die roll how well, did i keep a oh okay okay i have a i have a, I have a zero lander but it's actually a one lander because i have one MDFC. all right i have an mdfc and a bounce land it's a little bit slow, but you know, it's fine. No. It, it's fine. This eh, hand's not exciting, it's but it's fine. Whatever. Yeah. I guess I keep this hand. Yeah. Sure. Does anyone have a wheel of fortune in their hand? <laughs> You're not supposed to have it in your deck. Uh, <laughs> there's and, there's an exception for wheel of why fortune. Why would you specific. why would you even run wheel of fortune in your gruel deck? Do you know how much good, like better card draw you have available to your deck? It's wheel insane. of fortune though. It's pretty cool. Oh, no. Is it's it? Well, there's that could have been cool. In like that could have been true in like 2010. There's, but in 2020, there, green can draw enough cards. There's there's synergies though because part mm -hmm. of what my deck wants to do is get lands in and out of the graveyard. So mm -hmm. discarding is actually like relevant to why my you just deck. Like, why don't you just like draw 20 cards and then discard down to hand size? <laughs> it doesn't guess, work. I, 
Uh, yeah, I guess I could. I guess I could work too, Tomer, and you're <laughs> coming in with the logic. <laughs> I just like Wheel of Fortune, and it's probably slightly because you complain about it every time. Yeah. That, makes, that makes me more, that makes me and, more and likely just to likes put it in three my deck. Crim just likes managing. Am I the three. only one who adheres strictly to the rules? It seems to be that way. Uh, actually, hold on, Tomer. <laughs> No, Isn't no, running no. a warriorless warrior yeah. deck kind of like this? That's same not part thing? of the house rule. What, what what if you run like a hundred egregious cards instead I, of just one? You know what we should do is we should just buy out Cauldra and spike the price yeah. up to a hundred dollars just to show yeah. her how it feels <laughs> to have something you like be too expensive to play. <laughs> <laughs> Go I'm for happy. it! I played budget. You too. Make it happen. Three visits. Hashtag MTG Finance Cauldra buyout. So much ramp. Uh, I'm just gonna do this now. You would. No, man. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, wow. look, look at the value lands. you could now. Oh. You could wrath. Oh, and now six six mana from now, Strip you can mine. cast it as a wrath. <laughs> uh, if I draw my strip mine, I will definitely strip mine. Use it. I, 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 played, played, I played this. I played this deck <laughs> multiple times and it overperformed each time. And now on Commander Clash, it's looking bad, and all the comments are going to be like, "Oh, Tommy, you made a bad deck. Oh, you're running too many <laughs> you I already hear it now, and you're wrong. You're all wrong. Chat is wrong. All right, this deck is actually really good. It doesn't even oh, have that many so tap lands from his mulligan decision. <laughs> I don't even have that many tap lights. I literally am drawing oh. every single one. Oh, that's oh, I thought that was Zeth's card. That's right? probably like the best card in Grim's deck. Yeah, <laughs> it literally is. I, I've seen this in standard before. <laughs> uh, what do we get? Oh, it only okay. It only Good reveals thing. if it goes into play. Good thing we're full yeah. of interaction this week. So uh, <laughs> yeah, I was trusting that y'all would be doing the interacting. Why ramped? <laughs> Clearly, I I can't, I can't even. Uh, have a decent start, so. Oh, I hope I draw my strip mine. For for a crim, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah so. to... <laughs> okay. Bounce lands are just too tasty of a target. I can't really? pass it up. I can't pass it up. It's nothing really? personal. All right. Oh, yeah, you, uh, we did see the strip mine. I didn't play strip mine. I need oh. all my green mana. I'll also, <laughs> I'll also reiterate that this is a fifty dollar asterisk deck. It's not a strip mine. <laughs> <laughs> Man, the Zusa on top of your library. Yeah, Richard's kind of doing what I did last game. It looks like seems yeah, broken. I don't have any. I don't have the same card draw that you have. I'm so sad. Seems broken. <laughs> well, the MDFC again. It's back. <laughs> <laughs> it's back. Uh, do I want to use its ability? Yes. Why is that a question? Declined. Why would you say no to putting a quest counter on it? Because you ran out of counters and your counter pouch. And you don't want anyone to <laughs> Yeah, you don't have any more Fair. counters. True, true, true. <laughs> yeah, we should bring that back. Like, What's with like dice and stuff? Like, Bring back those little glass beads. Glass beads? Pennies. You Hasn't didn't use glass beads as counters? I had those. I uh, had them where you just kind of like, pile a bunch of them though. on. Yeah. Uh, They're like... Uh, what is that game? Go? I don't is know what, what the called? real the of purpose like of those, those beads pieces. are. <laughs> so much value over here. Yeah, I feel like I've seen this exact thing in Standard before. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I'm pretty ago, much playing. But... Why, why, why are you targeting me? We're friends. <laughs> well, I mean, what else am I targeting? I'm not going to ping somebody down for two. <laughs> <laughs> down could. to 38. Send a message. Oh, come on. Oh, Andy hit a land. Wow. Well, I mean, yeah, Krim's going off. Go, going off? Going, going off? Going off? <laughs> yes! Going off. Kill him. <laughs> going off? I put a land into play and have a 2 2 elemental. <laughs> it's you so kill weak. The Oracle of Medaya. That's like a 3 for 1. Kill him. <laughs> and now. You can attack someone. <laughs> Okay, that's All right. that's fair. So I, I expect to be the that's enemy. That's four this open game. mana. Do something. <laughs> flash it. <in>. Ether eyes. <laughs> no. <laughs> Got him. No, I, I don't really have uh, interaction this week for the most part. Just a tiny, <laughs> tiny bit. 
My interaction is Warp World. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> it interacts yeah. with everything. <laughs> That's disgusting, by the way, but yeah. There's How a d- card in my hand that hurts me as I stare at it. <laughs> How do you feel about Should cards like Warp World and Greater Aurora and Commander? Like, is that on the, like, mass land destruction side where people don't like it? Or is it different because you get stuff back, sort of? I think it's pretty funny. So, <laughs> I think like I've I've seen it played in like Wart uh, Raid Mother a lot, where like you make a bunch of clues with Tyler's Tracker or a bunch of tokens, and then you copy uh, Great Aurora with uh, Wart, and then you just like you know go crazy on it. I think it's a win condition. Like you're gonna have more. The idea of it is to have more permanence than everybody else. Oh wait, Warp World or Great Aurora? I mean, they're they're essentially the same. No, Great Aurora is. Oh, I guess yeah, they are both the same. I think I think they're used as win conditions in those decks. Like you, you're supposed you're supposed to be a token deck, and you just drop more stuff than your opponents, so that when you just mix them up, like you're gonna have you're gonna always be ahead of them. Um, yeah, that's, I think it's fine. That's kind of the main theory, and well, you can kind of do the same thing because you get like Scoot Swarm, you get Avengers Endicar. So there's a lot of like weird token producers that you can actually play in Omnath, so it seems like a natural fit. I guess if you close out yeah. the game, it's probably fine. It just, it's a lot of triggers on Moto. It's generally, well, like, the the only downside to playing, scr- like, uh, Warp World and Great Aurora is, generally speaking, one, if you have enough permanents to get ahead with Great Aurora, chances are you probably could have just won the game, like, a thousand different ways instead. Which is, like, I mean... Yeah. But it's the most fun way. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> At least it is a way to win. That's the reason why I don't like like straight up chaos decks is like when people run cards like these auction and uh scramble verse, they're not actually doing it to necessarily have it as a win condition. They're just doing it to like troll. And that that I cannot <laughs> abide. Hey. That I cannot <laughs> abide. This hand is just just a silly hand and everybody already is way ahead of me. Uh, have, okay, so Tover has two lands. <laughs> I have nine. Yeah. <laughs> Even I have more lands. It's more... Uh, can we get another bounce land to pick up that <laughs> the NDFC? No. I mean, I'm I'm not here not to play my meme card. So I, we got to see it. We got to see it. We didn't get. To yeah. See it last what what game. is it? Two, three. So what I could do is I could go. Yeah, I can only cast either the scout or the the regrowth this turn. Uh, the growth this time. Yeah, chat, so. chat wants the meme card. They told me. All right. So this yeah, card, yeah. this card, I actually run in all my budget blue decks. So do not. Do, I'm going to explain, but it's not. I'm, I'm already. Not bad. I'm already upset. I'm already upset. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> Are you kidding oh. me? <laughs> oh, that's insane. Are this you week. kidding me? <laughs> Look at this guy metagaming. Yeah, no, that, that is no, a very no, clever no, play. No, 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 no. Oh no. my god, he does have another bounce land. <laughs> Yes. You're going to give us flack for three visits? No, 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 no. I actually run Insight in all my blue decks wait, because it, as a budget inclusion, instead of running like Ristic Study, odds are your opponents, green is the most popular color in Commander. So odds are your opponents, at least one opponent is going to be running uh, green in their deck. If you have one opponent running green in their deck, Insight is actually really, really good. If you have multiple opponents, then it's amazing. It just so happens that this week, uh, I have three green opponents. <laughs> just so no, 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 no. I was running it. I was running it on on the the, the other stuff. The, the the other previous things that I did on on that. It was in the deck. It was in the I, deck. I was not playing against green decks knowingly. This was just the list that I carried over. So you know you can't be uh, upset. Somebody play the upset. card where each player sacrifices two lands. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna play come I'm gonna come to Tomer's defense. I actually have never seen this card before, but. I could actually just see myself playing. It actually seems like it would be pretty good in just like a random four player commander game. You, you know, I believe that because it's very low. Oh, okay. Sure. <laughs> I, yeah, I'm not sure why people haven't like. Sure. Sure. Oh. <laughs> Fine. Oh, you were, you were so close with that Colney Heart Expedition, Tomer. So close. <laughs> This is just not my week. What? This oh, deck performed power. so what well on stream. It performs so well on stream. I'm just getting dunked on because I'm just drawing all the wrong cards. <laughs> and my phone is drawing all the right ones. Wow. Oh, all right. Uh, should we Should we all just attack Tomer until he dies? <laughs> oh, oh, my goodness. On, I was joking. I was joking. No, he's hitting me. <laughs> uh. Oh, uh, 
Okay. I will um, not respond. That is what viewers want. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't Titana give it indestructible to something? No. Not this one, uh, at least. No. Just uh, returns the land and then when lands go to the graveyard, it makes it <laughs> elemental. All right. I am all out of cards, guys. <laughs> Seth? <laughs> You want cast the wheel. <laughs> I'm ready. If I if I if I draw it, I probably will cast it. I'm still hoping for my strip mine, but boy, if you can make that Omnath unblockable, it just one shot someone next turn. If you strip mine Tomer on top of that, that's so rude. <laughs> yeah, wheel into a strip mine. <laughs> Let's see it. Oh my god, even Azusa's is getting in on the fun. All right. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I have to pay a visit. To Tomer with Azusa, possibly three of them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <right>. I mean, <clears throat> I guess we just, I guess we just played this. Oh my god! Oh, in case anyone plays a flyer, play this. Crack this. Oh, sure. Now he just gets unlimited elemental. I turns. still only have one land drop each turn, which is awkward. But oh, I'm sorry, Seth. Yep, two. It sounds drops. awful. <laughs> How about me? I have unlimited land draws, but no lands in hand. Uh, well, I guess if I guess if hitting Tomer is what we agreed on, I'll, I'll send a little bit of love his way. I am worried about this Omnath, though. Why? Well, no, the, the Richard Omnath. I'm afraid of just oh, like, oh, hey, Rogue's hey. Passage. I have you one something. color. Leave me alone. What if that one card is Rogue's Passage or something similar? I would have played it already. I have Azusa. <laughs> <laughs> I'm baiting the strip mine. Please, Tomer, Tomer, have Blasphemous Act. So I can play my Rogue's Passage. <laughs> Please have Blasphemous Act, Tomer. Ooh, okay. Lot War Scout. That's good with Bounce Lands. Oh, boy. Oh, but it doesn't It doesn't work with the MDFC, though. That it does not. I think not. Tomer might be yeah. holding on to that now. That might be the game plan to actually try to cast it. Yeah. That actually is the line. But he needs... More white man. He does need, and yeah, Three. he needs a bunch Wait, more. Wait, what mana. is it? Eight? It's is it eight. Yeah, I think I think it's yeah, it is eight, right? Yeah, it's not nine. Never mind. He's getting there though. He's up to six, which means next turn. Wow, Tomer, is it? Have you gone silent, Jake mode? <laughs> no response. Or is he pushed to talk? Uh, <laughs> I'm giving the viewers the satisfaction oh. watching me get dunked on. Jake, Jake getting so, Jake getting so mad he would turn off his mic is one of my favorite early Commander Class <laughs> season moments. Oh, it no, cracks me up I every can't time. Win. <laughs> so if I react, people like it. If I turn it off, you like it. Like, oh my god. <laughs> Everyone just loves you, Toby. You're so likable. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, what are we? What are we doing there, Krim? With yeah. seven cards in hand, kill the titanium man. <laughs> I mean, ah, uh, <laughs> what are we killing the lot of war scout for the beams? <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> like, like the titania. <laughs> Hold one second. Wait, when does it trigger? Oh, only Omnath does it. I thought it was every elemental. Let me think here. Okay. Do you have the combo kill? I hate I hate this card so much. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Krim. Oh, I absolutely Krim, Krim, Krim. hate oh, this card oh, oh, oh. so much. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Oh, I hate it. <laughs> Good thing you have, like, one forest. You have two forests. Uh, and I the triumph, three. Wait, what's the other one? Oh, the trial. Yeah. Okay, well. Oh, now if I had an Issa, how much would you hate me? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Let's see here. What can I do with this? Yeah, this this Nissa needs to go, I think. No, can, no, it's not the you Nissa. Attack people. Y'all need to relax. It's not the Nissa. Or you play a Hydroid Crisis. <laughs> you are the right colors for this. It's <laughs> standard. Oh no. Okay, so now Krim has more mana than me, that's... but he actually has cards in hand. <laughs> yeah, it's a little a little frightening. How does reinforce work? <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea. Actually, is that you just like discard and put like some plus one plus one counters on something? 
That's like a Kitkin mechanic. I'm like, why do you have it in your deck? Okay, okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. If you reinforce, what does it do? No, not I think me. it just puts a counter on something. Maybe. No, no, it's like, this is, I thought some of this stuff actually triggered when plus one plus one counters, but nothing does. <laughs> uh... Well, oh, now, is, does he have eight lands? Two, four, six, seven. Uh, yeah, one short, I think. Yeah, just one short. It's cool. It's a big Risen Reef. Uh, make it my commander bigger. Ah, uh, boy. Uh, let me think here. We're we're in a lot of trouble, right? Because I mean, that Titanos Titania is gonna like dunk us. I, I don't know. I think the Nissa might dump us. Yeah, I, I'm. I'm <laughs> I, I feel like you're, what? you're the one that's us here, Graham. What are you talking about? <laughs> you're, de you're deflecting. You're deflecting. Trying to make you look like the <laughs> like the guilty party. I saw an I, event. I, I saw an event. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm not attacking into a nine nine or a huge army. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just attack me. I, but I, I, I feel like I need Tober alive. <laughs> oh, okay. You to deal alive. with this board state. <laughs> so I don't know if I want to contribute to Tober dying. You, you want to you, ramp? You want to donate him some planes? You, you, you heard of it. You heard it here first. I don't want Tober to die. I actually need to keep Tober around. Oh, I do need to kill this Nissa if I can. Why? <laughs> I don't know. Mana Is it even good? Can... Mana mana doublings, even with only like half your mana being doubled, is still pretty good, I think. No. <laughs> That's my counter argument. No. <laughs> All right. Seth, are we are we trying to kill Nissa? Why? Uh, yeah. Why are we trying that's to kill what Nissa? I'm going for is getting rid of Nissa this turn. That's my game plan. I'm not going after you, Richard. Or and I don't, don't really want to go after Tomer either. I feel a little feel a little bad for Tomer. <laughs> but he played the insight and gloated about it. <laughs> and we explained why I have it in the deck. I did not gloat. I was like, don't be mad. It was you in the like, I'm a genius. List. Look at all the cards I'm going to draw. <laughs> he was rightfully punished for, for the insight. But. Wow. Uh, all right. I got, I I got the bad wreck, guys. Decks. I did it. All of my blue budget decks has it. And people would know yeah. about it because I made a video on it that nobody watched. So that's great. Oh, you know what I should put in my deck? The Godzilla card that cycles and puts a trample counter on stuff. Oh, yeah, that would actually be insane. But it's not in my deck. Yeah, Richard, know. why would we not attack Seth, who is building an army? You're building an Wait, army, Wait, I too. thought we all hate Nyssa. If I, okay, so, like, if I if I just let my Nyssa die... We're cool. Okay. I mean, I literally have... I just have a one nine nine Omni. I have nothing to do. I, I can't do anything. What? What do you want your goblin, your bright hearth banneret for? Hmm. I mean, at this point, right? Because like, cause it's not going to make its rounds, right? Like, no matter what, example, Seth will then just swing in with four bodies. I'd have to trade my whole board to keep Nyssa. Yeah, it's probably not worth it. All right, I did it, Krim. Nyssa's sounds down. worth it. No. Old, old, old Krim would enjoy this. Yeah, not yeah, yeah. yeah not new Krim. <laughs> what are you talking about? I love Nyssa. It's my favorite oh, card. Are we dead? Okay, it's an odd man. Okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah. now someone deal with Titania again. <laughs> oh, yeah, someone, think... someone lure up my Omnath. <laughs> we can do it. We just need some cards. Oh, yeah. Except I can't even attack him anymore. Like two elementals will take out Omnath. Omnath Locus Rage pretty powerful, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. This when turns out this landfall thing Omnath is pretty deck, good. Yes. <laughs> oh, with I'm the, just shocked, honestly. You know, with the ancient <laughs> Greedworn too for double the elementals. Ooh, oh, jeez. That is that's pretty good. So what do we do? Win the game again? Yeah, win the game. I don't think I At any point. Here. Like this is this is what I got for this turn. I don't even so know if every, I attack. So every time he keeps getting it fetch land back, makes like four five power. five elementals, yeah. Hmm. Seems good. <laughs> so if I so if I attack Krim. I will block Titania so fast you don't even know. It's actually not that great to attack you, honestly. All right, I'm just gonna Good pass. Good friends. 
Yeah, let's, let's see <laughs> once again, Richard. I don't know why we hit me. What am I? Gonna, I can't deal with Titania. I have a big, dirtily beater. <laughs> yeah, but it's but the thing here is, at some point, Seth would have to block, right? Because I mean, Seth would have to throw something in front so that Withers is bored. Now we really need his board, like board withered down. So now we really need to keep Tomer alive. Tomer might. Tomer I might guess have that's the true. Wrath maybe maybe that was poor threat assessment. You should have made these arguments beforehand. <laughs> Tomer could have the wrath. Well, yo, and willy nilly, like I'm gonna kill Crim's Nissa. <laughs> Yeah, I, I see Nissa. Nissa needs to die, okay? I mean, I agree. Don't get me wrong. I agree. <laughs> All right, Tomers. Ooh. Players can't pay life or sacrifice. Oh, that actually shuts players. down my, my fetch land synergy. Okay, Aha! okay. Tomers are savior. So right now we really got to protect Tomer. And it gets the mana for the wrath next turn. So if Tomer is still wrath, around. Though. He's just going to instantly die to the Omnath. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I guess that's true. This is, the, this is why Omnath yeah, is so good. Have, right? You actually have to. We have to remove Omnath first. Yeah. Which Omnath? Uh, the, yours. The commander. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when you say Omnath on Omnath week, it's a little vague. <laughs> it's a little vague. Oh boy. So Tomer can wrath next turn. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hmm. Hmm. Tomer can wrath next turn, and we need Tomer see a next turn. <laughs> yeah. Wait. Wait. Does that have enough power? I Hold on. Tomer doesn't power. have. Does he have triple white? Isn't it just double? No, it's, it's triple it, white. It's triple. Double. Wait. He didn't ramp. He didn't ramp the basic it's, planes. Oh, it's not Yashar. double. It's not triple. I thought it was triple. It's, well, he got a double. planes with uh, Yasharn, but it goes to hand, so he does have it for oh. next turn. No, uh, yeah, the planes is in hand, so if it's double white... It is double. Okay. Um, so we, we need to keep him alive. How do we keep him alive? You just kill Omnath. Yeah. No, no, no. If you kill Omnath, you're still dead. But if I just swing yeah. all yeah. the like at you. you. Just cast the buyback uh, fog. Creeping mist yes. or something? Constant mist? If I, if I had the constant mist. You always have the constant mist. <laughs> <laughs> That's your like if there was a signature spell book, Richard, constant miss, <laughs> Teferi's protection, uh probably true conviction, and then like some like two bad kithkin. and and basically any hey, of hey. them. The kithkin would be the face cards. They would be that secret kithkin, lair bonus. Secret lair, it would be the greatest secret lair sellout of all time. Yeah. If they made mechanically unique Kithkin, people would be like, what is this? No one buys it. <laughs> I, 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 I'd do no like a cares. grab bag. Grab bag. Any any random Kithkin as a face card. Then it would be three visits, uh, constant miss, uh, uh, protection. Do we, and Do we want Ancient Warden or do we want uh, Titania gone? How about the Obnath? I That's given. <laughs> that's a given. Oh, okay. oh you're, you're going after two uh, of my things, Krim? Krim, Krim, Krim. Probably the Titania because Titania is going to make a huge yeah. army of elementals once. Uh... Wait, no. How does that work? It's only lands, right? Yeah. I thought but I want to be friends. I want insurance that you actually cast that sweeper. What, what insurance do you want? I like. Are, are you going to for sure cast it? What else am I going to do? You have six cards, Tober. <laughs> do you think I'm going to win the game <laughs> with mean... my fifty dollar asterisk <laughs> on that deck next turn? There's a chance. Is that what you're afraid of? This After I had such a blisteringly fast start? Yeah. Okay. Well, you do what you want to do. I'm giving you no chances. <laughs> Probably the Green Warden? Wait, the Titan? So the Green Warden lets him continually play the Windswept Heath. But I guess you can't sack it anymore because Yeah, it doesn't really do anything anymore. Thanks, Tomer. I'm just trying to have a little fun over here. I mean, you might just have an answer to you, Sharon, because you do have six cards in hand. Yeah, but I don't really play interaction. That's true. <laughs> I wasn't I wasn't lying when I said that. Unfortunately, yeah. the budget deck has to be the one with the answers. Ooh, MDFC. Oh, oh, oh MDFC. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Look at it go. Wow, that's a lot of Yo, you, damage. Use the MDFC that puts a plus one, plus one counter set. Wait, how did you... <laughs> okay, wait. Oh, oh guess... wait, no, this this kills your shrine, doesn't it? Yeah, but my fetch land doesn't do much anymore. I think I have to send a message to Krim. Uh, okay. Uh... 
Oh, you have to use two triggers? Oh, you can kill his lands. Mass land destruction. I could. You, <laughs> well, you can kill the Dryad Arbor, too. Uh, I could blow up two lands, I guess, couldn't I? Yeah, you could what blow you up mean? two lands. How? What lands? What? You, you mean my forest? That's a 3-3 <laughs> three, three, and that's it? Uh, So, I kind of feel like I'm supposed to kill Risen Reef, actually. Or Dryad, uh, because of Valakut. I mean, does... does uh, oh, well, hold on. I don't, I don't play Valakut. I, I hate that card. Uh, <laughs> oh, the Risen Reef too? is just so many more cards. I do, oh. I, so, but like that one actually just does a lot for the for the deck. I thought you I hate got the argument. Cram only has seventy nine no, no, cards no. in deck. He's drawn two more All cards right. than you. All right, we're gonna kill. We're gonna kill the Risen <laughs> Reef. Sure, 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 sure. All right. So did, let's see. Did you spend fourteen mana on that? How in the world? <laughs> Oh, it doubles. That's right. I forgot. It doubles. Ah, it I forgot if it's six. Okay, so. that makes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that was impressive. Attack Tomer. All right. Attack Tomer. I mean, <laughs> you want to attack? Tomer's gonna die. You're gonna, gonna lose all your sweet elementals. You, you need to send some stuff into Seth and force some blocks to keep Tomer alive. Remember how you want? No, me he to has five fives. Him. Okay, but if you attack yeah. me, I'm not. I'm not attacking you, Tober. Why would I attack you? I told you I need your board. I don't life. know. I don't know why you do things, Crim. I don't know. <laughs> I told you already, Crim. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I do have a big Omnath. If you attack me, I'm just gonna hit you back. This is for Nissa. <laughs> you wanted Nissa. Wow, gone. Crim defending Nissa. Wow, podcast. I never thought I'd see I know, the day. I know. I know. It's wild. Nissa. Never thought I'd see the day. This is the timeline. This is the timeline. <laughs> uh, why are you double jumping? Plus, well, I mean, at the we're gonna lose all our stuff anyways. Oh, yeah, I guess that makes sense. I still am worried Richard's just gonna one shot someone, but less worried because now I mean now Richard probably is about to one shot somebody. <laughs> well, if he casts like if his last card is Ingurx, uh, like Return of the Wild Speaker or something, that would be really awesome. Oh, yeah, it'd be insane. That would, wouldn't it Genesis be? Genesis wave. <laughs> no. Oh, 20 floating mana. That's fine. With 11 oh. on board. Oh, he only has two cards in hand. Yeah, but that, that's still pretty scary. Hmm. <laughs> 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 mm? <laughs> do what we, do you mean? Did we win this turn? No, we don't. Did we break it? Is it Dark Steel Plate? Because that's actually very problematic that Omnath is that big in state. Oh, that's, what? That's not Why great. would you play a bird? It's out of any color. Die. It could be anything. <laughs> <laughs> Are you running Farseek oh. in your deck? Hit Seth. No. Hit Seth. Hit Seth. I'm going to die if I hit uh. Seth. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Huh? Huh. So. Yep. I'm dead. Oh, should I attack Tomer? Do I even want to attack Tomer? You know what? Everyone everyone is so so gung ho for a board wipe. Maybe I'll just help out. Oh, this dead. this is not gonna be good. <laughs> this is not gonna be good for us. <laughs> oh <laughs> am I, No Am I dead? One two so Things will happen. I don't know what happens. Who knows? 20, 5, 30, 35, You're not taking 40. any damage here. Uh, I will. What are you uh, taking damage from? All your tokens? I don't have well, Omnath. Like, Omnath. there's no... this. All this does is shuffle stuff up and random stuff's gonna yeah, happen. We just get random stuff happening. I mean, I don't know. That birds. Maybe just I hit stuff permanent. that kills you, but it doesn't kill you when it resolves. He needs, he needs haste or something. But then you will get stuff, too, so... How yeah, I'm helping you. Taking... Z I feel like zero. very rarely does Great Aurora help. <laughs> I mean, you all have... Well, I mean, Crim's Crim board is just as big. It's not bad for Crim, yeah. I don't think. It's not bad for Richard, probably, oh, either, being empty-handed. Library. I'm not sure. I can counter this. Oh. I, well, if I you counter would. it, then I'm swinging everything at you, I think. Yeah, that's the problem. Are you going to yeah. not attack me if... Uh... Yes, I will not attack you if it resolves. That can't be good. <laughs> he can't attack you. I can't. <laughs> mean? All his creatures will be gone. What? Well, well, no. If he counters it, then I just swing everything at him and kill him. No, no you don't. Well, I mean, no, I, I he take blocks. Twenty. I take you would take thirty. Four, you could. 
Yeah, you would go to down to two. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not doing that. <laughs> no, yeah, but just, the thing just, is, just, I, just we, let the we, great we, aurora resolve. I think. The great aurora yeah, is gonna bad. also just lose us the game anyways. Right? I'm gonna go down to not, two. I'm gonna lose the game anyway if I go down to two. To what? Yeah. I, From what? I, and then I, I spend my entire turn wiping the board on my turn. No, thank you. Yeah, but but we would. I I will tell you right now that I will not kill you. I will not do anything. <laughs> okay, to you. I'm still at two. It's good for you, Krim. You want this great aurora? Yeah, the great aurora is helpful for you. No, I don't. No, I don't. No, you I have don't. some good cards in hand. Oh, he just has some <laughs> insane card in hand. All right, that gives me even more reasons to do it. I don't <laughs> have an insane. I part. I have parcel insurrection <laughs> or something. It's got to be. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm gonna put it. All right. Lands. I need Ob- Wait, does Omnath? Our commanders shuffle in, right? Or no? I think you get to no, choose. Th- they go to. No. Oh. What um. happened? All right. Do I want what my happens? commander Who to knows? shuffle in? If I shuffle, I want my commander to shuffle in and come back on the battlefield so I keep all my mana. <laughs> wow, that's risky. You're going to see, what, 12 cards? Odds are not in I favor. I can also <laughs> shuffle in and draw a cord of calling or something and <laughs> do like, it, fetch him back do out. It, yeah. do I mean, you it. have 30 mana floating. It's all going to go it, away, though. Do it, do it. Oh, wait, how many? One, two, three. All right, we're doing it. What are you doing? Okay. If Omnath would change zones, it goes to. <laughs> and not command zone, command zone instead of library. It goes to library, not command zone. All right. Oh, Richard, wow, really? That's so risky. <laughs> yeah, we're doing it. I mean, I can't, I can't, I'm so behind and like, <laughs> this is it. Isn't your deck no, but- built around Omnath though? <laughs> I have yeah, ways like, to fetch Omnath back out, so it's not like it's the end of the world if I don't get the Omnath back, right? So, but it, it would be incredible. If uh, I could get, did the game there. just break? Why is everything in my hand? Oh yeah, yeah you gotta put your, you hand? gotta choose to put your lands into play. Oh, How? did I have six? Oh, you have three lands. Oh wait, Doctor Anime has it. Yeah, it's me first. Oh, this wasn't oh actually, that's not great. I don't know how beneficial <laughs> this was for me actually. I can't cast any of my spells now. I don't have any green mana sources. <laughs> Wait. Oh, I, 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 I just One, draw two, the three, worst. Four, like, I have five, so many green mana sources in my deck. And I hit two of my, my... How many colorless lands do I have? I have two colorless lands in my deck, and they I drew both. All right, so we all we all get lands back. Oh, we have a Valkyrie. Oh, I do have a Valkyrie. Wait, we did Valkyrie to death? Wait, how did you have so many lands? He put MDFCs also. <laughs> yeah. Still, he had that many permanents? Jeez. Yeah, all the tokens. Um, I don't know what I do now, though. Nothing? Okay. You have a Valakut. I guess we'll just... Yeah, but it's not doing anything. I only have one, two, three, four... Oh, well, I guess I almost have five. All right, let's play this. Make, oh boy. make a make a few if plans. That was, if that was on the battlefield. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is actually fine. I have a cycler. Wait a minute. There's some weird bug here where <laughs> I can see Omnath sitting in my library. What? What? Interesting. Do you see where you know where it's when you're gonna be drawing it, essentially? No 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 no. There, there's a there, there's like a window that says your library and like Omnath is like sitting in it. So I yeah. can control like his um like where he goes, in case you like I don't know mill my deck or something. I guess I can put on that oh. back. In the, in the thing. Huh? That must That's be new. Awesome. I guess I've never really seen people shuffle their commander back into their library before, though. So yeah, by <laughs> choice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, all right, we're gonna. That's weird. I thought we also got to play, get all of our permanents into play. So Warp World puts all the permanents into play. Oh right, this right, one. Right, there we go. This one you still got to cast your permanents, but you get to put lands into play. Should I strip mine your blue source, Tomer? Uh, I mean, if that's what you want to do. <laughs> no, I'll, I'll wait. I'll wait for a bounce land. Wow, it worked, Richard's <laughs> Tomer, ridiculous please, plan. Please, please, I beg you, <laughs> Tomer, please. <laughs> <laughs> I'll allow it. Countering it would be like destroying twenty four lands at once. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I gotta click the right it. thing. Hold on. I can't believe you. Drew Wind it. Don't get bigger. I can't believe that worked either. 
Right. Yes. Wow. The gambit paid off. Wow. I'm a genius. Me too. I'm a That's genius. Insane. <laughs> wow. That's like look at that. Richard. And a full grip of cards yeah, with that gets much to mana. Keep his mana. I'm a genius. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually not that bad because I have like corn and green sun scenes and stuff. I can actually pull them back out even if this failed. Although I don't know, I have like five lands, so maybe not. <laughs> uh, okay. I guess we crack this. Ha wow. All right. We're in trouble. <laughs> We're, I think, yeah, now this Omnath is really scary if you don't have a, <laughs> if you don't have any blockers. Oh, oh well, the Omnath is really scary, says Seth with, like, an insane board state as I well. mean, I, I have plenty of plans to block it, but I'm <laughs> still a little, I'm still a little worried that <laughs> it's going to go unblockable and kill me, but, huh, maybe this deck is pretty powerful i've never played omnath locust rage before somehow in whoa all these years Lane of Fall commander decks clash. are good in commander uh apparently <laughs> apparently so hey. it's almost like you naturally want to play things that put lands into play anyway so it just makes yeah. all your cards insane uh i'll go my green source uh so this is this is not looking good i mean like anything that i can do to that Omnath does not work when it's a 25-25. <laughs> Yo, let's see, let's see that Shatter Skull. <laughs> yeah. Shatter Skull Summit for 25? Okay, give me a minute. <laughs> Seth's the only one that can block it. Put, put them on the battle. Oh, untapped. Okay, this is good. I mean, relatively. Are we are we ramping? I mean, I have I had three lands on the battlefield. Hmm. Wait, what? Uh, who are you going to attack <laughs> with Omni, Richard? Are, are you... I don't know. We'll see how the board shapes up after this. I mean, you, you do have a lot of plants. Hmm. You know you need us, <laughs> Richard. You know you need us. <laughs> Am I the bad guy again? <laughs> you have the most lands. Uh, I mean, let me cast this. What? No, no, no. Wrong side. Wrong side. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Uh, uh, you couldn't even cast the other side. All right. I think. You leave my Omnath alone, Seth. <laughs> I think I gotta. I think I gotta do this just in case. Whoa, 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 whoa. We could be friends. <laughs> wow. Oh. I we are I'm, I'm giving you a beast. Uh you probably oh, you probably have heroic summer. intervention. Vale of, or, summer. Vale of summer doesn't do it, but I know heroic intervention. Funny. Oh crop rotation. Oh. oh, are you getting uh, the one the regenerate? Maya's whatever? Yeah. No. The regenerate one? That would be pretty disgusting. Well, you did save yourself because that would have been a rogue's passage. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so oh, good. So now we never kill this Omnath. <laughs> and and Richard gets a beast, so I did help. See, we are friends, nice. Richard. I knew I knew that that's what you're gonna do. I was just trying to give you a beast. <laughs> so uh -huh. just, yeah, we're friends now. Yeah, so? to strengthen yeah. our <laughs> our relationship, <laughs> <laughs> you to attack yeah. other people. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I can see how this. I can see. I can see it. Tell her once again, good, we must be friends. <laughs> I have actually done nothing to tell her this game. What? My Call right? Heart Expedition and Insight? Remember that? Oh, I forgot. I, for, I forgot about <laughs> yeah, those. Oh, that was this game. Those oh, yeah. I <laughs> those don't count. Wait, enters the battlefield. Oh, I thought it enters the battlefield. Tapped. Uh, I could have done one more thing. The Abacus never forgets. Man. I well, I mean, even even if that's true, Tomer, you need we, we we need to be friends. Uh huh. I'm not doing anything all game. Just just in case you 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 didn't know, huh? Man, I didn't realize it comes into play untapped. I could have played. I could have suspended search for tomorrow. Ah, uh. <laughs> Tomer's still desperately trying to build up his lands. <laughs> uh. Wait, why do you have all basics? What? Oh, because he harrowed. All right, goodbye, Mary Shepard. You're a little bit too ambitious right now. Uh, am I still dead next turn, Richard? 
Huh? Well, am I, am I nice. still dead or no? Ooh. Wow. Oh, wow. Are you actually going to do the direct damage? And, wow. Are you, what you is, just trying to get Are you just killed? setting this up so <laughs> Richard can kill me? Is that the plan? No, that's not the plan. Oh, is he actually <laughs> has enough damage to kill Omna? Uh, <laughs> regrowth, cast it again. <laughs> Bal again. That's a lot of. It's a lot of mana now. The, the creatures are dead. <laughs> regrowth, get Nissa. Oh, cast it again. <laughs> oh, I wasn't expecting. What, what is your plan here? I wasn't expecting. Like you did. This. You did. You did. Just leave the door open for Seth getting murdered. I think that's the <laughs> I plan. Mean, just like <laughs> hope that you choose to kill me instead of him. You gotta be faster oh. than the last guy, right? That's all you gotta do. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah. Was this the plan? I'm work. curious. Or does Coop have something up his sleeve? <laughs> I mean, I guess he could play oh. a blocker. One, two. And then. Ah. You just need a chump blocker and you're safe. What is the line here? Let Seth die. <laughs> I mean, that is that is true, but <laughs> oh, crim, crim, crim. I I will remember the last one. This act. Wait, what does this do? Whenever you cast a creature, okay, Animar, it's great. It's your friend. What's going on, Animar? Are you boy. countering it? Oh wait, hold on. No. <laughs> mm. Floating more mana. Okay, of course. That's so I'm not this. Maybe maybe Richard will click through his attack step. This is a very real possibility. <laughs> I think <laughs> I think that's my lie. only hope at this point. <laughs> you drew back into the arcane signet after it got shuffled in. Yeah, yeah, after it got <laughs> shuffled away. Uh, your turn. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh, that was that was just for Seth. Who knows? That was just a little alley you persistent. Yeah. Uh, I mean, who knows what Tomer could do if he untaps Richard? <laughs> he does have the scariest Omnath. We've seen what it can you do in standard. You guys are afraid of budget decks. We've seen uh, what it can do in standard. That might be the right choice. He's up to like six lands now. That could <laughs> that could allow him to Bobby. cast to cast things. <laughs> That is, there, there is something to be said about that. <laughs> okay. and it's we'll weird that just some. because Tomer's playing that Omnath, I am actually, like, so worried. Like, I know that, you know, Richard has obviously got an unkillable 28-28, mm. but mm -hmm. still, it's four-color Omnath. Mm. And I think All it's right. just from the bad beats from Standard that have scarred me into just always being afraid of that Omnath. <laughs> Seth has more mana, so he's a, he's scarier. I mean, he has a Valakit. Am I, <laughs> am I dying? I didn't know you guys had such long arms. Because that was quite the reach. <laughs> wow, you're, <laughs> you're actually going to kill me twice. You have commander lethal and actual lethal with this attack. Exaxes. We did it. Exaxes. A little more. Yeah, this, this is for, this is for the preemptive. Oh, little <laughs> little <laughs> preemptive. Trying to murder my Omnath. <laughs> Yeah, I if Seth that. if Seth would have killed your Omnath, I wouldn't have wiped his board. <laughs> I tried, I did try. Good game. Jeez, okay. you have six now cards. Now we can in have hand? some fun. Now we can have fun. Okay, I'm worried. Okay. Now we can have fun. We're dead. <laughs> no, can't. you're not dead. Oh, oh my gosh! <laughs> how much? How much? Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Uh, sure, Richard. Sure, yeah. you got it. Okay. Yeah. We already. You know what? Come on. At this point, Genesis that card wave. is that reads unkillable. So, do you, do you have the Rogue's Passage? Okay. Oh my okay. gosh. We're yeah. good. We're good guys. Okay. Oh my gosh. Uh, I have a lot of cards in hand. Hold on. How do I? Can I just deck myself. Or do I have a lab maniac in this deck? I'll tell uh, I don't ask for much, but I need an untapped land off the top. Please have one. Oh, wait. Does it get around and regenerate? <laughs> oh, I can't stop Richard. I just wanna, okay. I just want to perform things as well. I came, but I actually, if if I didn't uh, goof with Beanstalk Giant, I just thought I came in to play tap. I actually could have had a decent next turn. Man, that <gasps> sucks. <gasps> Hold on, hold on, hold on. Are we are hold we dead? On. Hold on. Did we break I it? I read all my cards. 
didn't break it. I just, <laughs> I just need ways for... What does this card do? Does this card break it? I feel like chat can help me with a combo. <laughs> chat. <laughs> chat, help him out. Come on, we're waiting. Where's where's my... I didn't even draw a single like Azusa or anything. I can't play additional lands. No. I don't think you need additional lands. But I do. Do, do you though, Richard? But I do. With 33 mana in the bank? <laughs> But I do. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, just give me a moment, guys. Like you have to keep scrolling back and forth to figure out what all of my uh, screen from Zenith. He drew too many cards. <laughs> so when I get when I get overwhelmed with options, you know, like you go to like uh, you go to like you go to like a restaurant and they have like eight pages for their menu. I just get overwhelmed and I just pick something at random. So that's what I recommend. Yeah. How do I protect my combo? Wait, 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 wait. wait you wait, have a wait, combo? Wait, 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 wait. What is? What is? This your is this is worth it. Trust, guys. Don't you have Remember when Seth was really winning? Uh, okay, okay. So first we will. Yeah. Uh, Mono green is this. never shy combos. That I do know. <laughs> okay. 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 Very good. <laughs> very good. Very good. Very good. Uh. Okay, okay, very good, very good. Yeah, you have an 84 unspent mana. It's cool. Yeah. Very good, very good, very good. Oh, oh okay, yeah. Very good, very good, very good. <laughs> <laughs> that is so much. That doesn't seem like lethal, though. Very good, very oh. good. Oh! Ah! Okay. Uh, oh, very okay. Good. Oh, so if Richard makes it to his next turn, he wins. Well, if he gets to untap stuff, then he wins. Well, he has to wait till his upkeep, right? Or does he oh, look yeah. to go win immediately? Yeah, I have to wait for upkeep. Yeah. Oh, oh, it. Very good, very good. Oh, it being the upkeep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't I don't have a... <laughs> I don't have a way to destroy the Helix Villain. I'm just throwing it out there. You just got... Uh, oh, okay. Oh, you just got to destroy... Just, just something happens. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll get right on that. All right, very good. Easy. Very good. Do you have path? Do you have path to exile? <laughs> Easy. Easy clap. You got him. If you just get a path to exile, you're fine. He has no no hand size. Okay. I guess I'm rooting for Richard to <laughs> die since he killed me. That's okay. I might actually just draw cards and kill myself. If I oh. cast like the Soul's Majesty, I'll just die. <laughs> Wow. I think, I think I think we're okay guys. Just leave me alone so I can heal critical. I don't have any way to protect this too. That I? is a Hold that on. is a It has shroud. <laughs> it has shroud. What do you need for protection? There's only a board wipe that could stop it. And then you just like cast heroic intervention. You wouldn't play that, would you, Richard? <laughs> no. <laughs> How is the Omnath only a five five right now? Yeah, what happened to Omnath? What? Mana doubling <laughs> the mana cube broke Omnath. Oh. Oh, we're good. Okay, now he's <laughs> DQ. Interesting. What? Maybe the Oh yeah. wow. Yeah, wow. It died. Oh, it died. Wait, what? Why did Omnath just randomly <laughs> die? <laughs> <laughs> well it was sick of your shenanigans. Well you better, yeah. <laughs> you better dump that man into Helix Pinnacle real quick. <laughs> What happened? Oh. <laughs> huh. Uh, 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 he figured it out. Why did you just, it why'd you just again? die again? Yeah. Ah, oh, damn! <laughs> oh, come on! <laughs> that might actually be good, yes! though. It's like a combo with... <laughs> with no, no, it went to the yard. It went it to the yard. The oh. Yard. <laughs> no, no, no. We can go back to the command zone. But why? <laughs> Are we missing something? I get doubly cube. I guess Moto didn't track the fact that double like yeah, double, double cube, cube like made the not, mana right, and then I guess yeah, the Omnath doesn't track it or something. Oh, oh, come on, that's game. That's game. Okay, you can't on. even untap. So how are you gonna get out of this? That's yeah, definitely you can, you can only untap when they tap. Next time you tap, yeah, right. you can't untap. Oh, uh, but no. we're still dead. 
I you mean, unless have... Tomer has that board wipe. You just gotta kill, I don't. You just got to kill Richard. Yeah, but you can still draw it. I, I don't have the mana for it. Oh, Tomer, no. Remember the Great Aurora? I do remember that. <laughs> At least I contributed. Right. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. All right. I can't. All right. All right. We'll just I can't do some. Oh, okay, fine. We'll just do some <laughs> MLD here. And this is, I don't have an Omnath anymore. Uh, we'll just, we'll just put all the counters on Helix Pinnacle. I don't even think you need the ca- the Helix Pinnacle at this point. No, oh, but it's a Helix Pinnacle deck. <laughs> <laughs> we need, we need it. <laughs> even with Moto dunking on Omnath. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, Moto just does not like Omnath. Okay, and then we double it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. We did it. Yeah. We did it. Just don't remove counters now. <laughs> okay. Easy. Be the progress, please. Here we go. Be the progress, please. <laughs> <laughs> Can Tomer save the day? I have a nature's claim, but that's not gonna do it. Ooh, you could. You need a shadow sphere. Oh, I guess that's hexproof, not shroud, right? Hmm. Apparently, like, is it Vorinclex? That's like, oh, that's such a gross card. Uh Yeah. It's a pretty gross card. Kind of like Nissa. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, may, I may concede before the Nissa comes down. <laughs> oh, just, am I running that too? Oh, no, it's revealed. You just <laughs> tap to forest to tap a forest? Well, I'm going to get planes off that, but yeah. You got a planes? No, no, the search from tomorrow is going to get uh, uh, planes. I suspended a card. Oh. Yes, yes, very good, very good, very good that you suspended a card. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so... All right. Come on, just, just let the Helix Pinnacle be. <laughs> Leave it alone. <laughs> I don't... How do you deal with it what if he stifles the trigger <laughs> he would play a card like that then you would win the, <laughs> no. the next turn still right cyclonic yeah, rift but that's just another turn for things to go wrong just cyclonic <laughs> rift i can't cast omnath ever again so <laughs> <laughs> cream would play cyclonic rift i wouldn't that's <laughs> correct okay okay yes that's a cavalier yes come on this is the standard deck all over again. Oh, you don't have the Risen Reef anymore. Oh. <laughs> okay, draw some cards. Uh... <laughs> so, these these are good sounds. Good thing I killed Seth before Moto bugged out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think it's safe to say I'm dead. Um, but to Helix, I mean, we're all we're all matters. dead. Yeah, we're all dead. We're all so dead this inside. Is, this is great. This is great. This is great. <laughs> yes, yes, I know. I know. Warren clicks. Yes, I know. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Every time. <laughs> yes. Look at the triggers. <laughs> look at the triggers. Uh yes, that is that is that is correct. <laughs> steal the <laughs> doubling cube or something? You can't yeah, even steal dark. the cube. It's three mana. Is it three? I thought it's two. Oh wait, no, no you're right. You're right. It's three to activate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you're right. I, mean, I can't even float oh. mana, but okay, I guess. <laughs> All right. You have some plans of doubling your mana and killing your own commander with it. Um. Oh, thank God I didn't steal the Helix Pinnacle. <laughs> that would have been He's like Shadow Sphere. Oh, I wish that's how that card worked. <laughs> Take it. <laughs> okay, so all right, so everything now costs three less, right? Sure. Wait, what? Creatures. From my... Creatures cost three less. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My my creature spells. Yes. Wait, why do your creature spells cost three less? Animar. Do you have Bane of Progress? Oh, he has an Animar. Because that would be hilarious. Don't, 
Don't you dare, Chrome. <laughs> Leave the Helix Pinnacle alone. <laughs> I mean, you have to cast it if you if you have it. Oh, that's a Dryad. Okay. Okay. Uh huh. Now I have all the mana I need for that. I can do. Go ahead and play that. And that. Okay. All right. So now. Cast that. Yeah, 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 Boring Collect. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Every time. I know. <laughs> oh, that's not a pain in progress. All right. So one, two, three, four. I have four to deal. Uh, so let's see. I'll go ahead and blow up that. Take your Seedborn out. Yeah. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> that seems good. All right. And then... Now we go ahead and do this part. Huh? Lose? <laughs> so that's yeah. six damage on Tomer. Uh-huh. He's trying to get second. <laughs> <laughs> is that actually what this is all about? <laughs> you know we die at the same time to Eli's Pinnacle, right? That's why he's trying to kill you. <laughs> Dude, how is he killing me? That is that the most it. grim thing. <laughs> Man... And then, uh, lastly, okay. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> Richard has got it. He likes he likes Let's, does it actually work, or will I just die somehow? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's not a lot of outs. You have to have like a mass. You have to have a board wipe. Yeah, I had to have my. I, I know for a fact that uh, like, cause I, I, that's why I try to draw with the cavalier. Mm -hmm. Here's my well. hand. I had a sort of mana drain. <laughs> <laughs> that that one actually fits in the budget. Awkward. Yeah, this yeah. one's way more in the budget. I actually had the win. Uh, I wouldn't. Yeah, you would. I had. Wait, I had how are you gonna I win? I had the win. Um, so I had a uh, Rune Ghost and Retreat to Coral Helm in my hand. And what what those two cards do? Rune Ghost. Uh, you can pay one white and tap it to blink a land you control. Um, and Retreat to Coral Helm says it has landfall. And it says uh, you can untap. Whenever a land enters the battlefield, you untap target creature. So you can bounce. You can you can use Rune Ghost to bounce a to blink a pay tap tap a planes pay paying for Rune Ghost uh, to blink that planes and enters the battlefield untapped. And then when it enters the battlefield, uh, Coral Helm untaps it. So you can just do that infinite time for infinite landfall triggers. And then if you have any landfall creature or enchantment or whatever that says whenever a land enters the battlefield, uh, you make a token. And I had two of those in my hand. Uh, you just make infinite landfall triggers, uh, infinite uh, tokens, or with tunneling geopede, you just do infinite damage to your opponents. Uh, so that's a primary win condition of the deck. And I had, I had it in my hand, but because I didn't realize that Beanstalk Giant... Uh, puts the the card into play uh, tapped or uh, untapped. Uh, I could have set up for... I could have gotten a green mana source instead, uh, suspended Search for Tomorrow, and set up like a, a pretty solid uh, turn next turn uh, to do Rune Ghost and the other thingy and then win. But I uh, didn't really get there. And I think I think uh, Richard, Richard won anyway because I would have needed an extra turn after that. Um, but yeah, it was close. Okay, I'll just I'll just explain my deck then. Uh, I think it did really really poor showing, and it was just like a really bad early draw. Uh, I did play this game this deck a bunch, and it's done a lot better before. And this these games are just a bad showing, and honestly, it's gonna be it's gonna be slower in general because of the budget, right? Like I don't have exploration, I don't have burgeoning, I don't have like the most I don't have the most expensive ramp sources, so it's going to be inherently slower than, you know, more tuned uh, green decks are going to be. But, I mean, I don't need Avenger of Zendikar. I don't need a lot of the cards that kind of eat up a lot of the budget usually because I have alternatives that work just as well. And I have combos that just outright win the game just as well as the more expensive uh, versions of, like, a landfall deck would be. So I think the deck is actually really strong. And it's relatively fast uh, because you are in green. It's just that... I, I drew all the wrong lands at the beginning, which kind of sucked. But I, I'm still re I really like this deck. I think it's, it's a really solid deck for fifty dollars asterisk. 
Uh, yeah. But anyway, enough about my deck. Let's hear about Seth's deck, which we got to see basically go off last game. Uh, this game, you were getting close to it as well. Yeah, I mean, obviously, Omnath is a pretty powerful commander, and... It's pretty easy to make it good and doubly so now that Zendikar Rising's out and we have even more good landfall stuff. Uh, I was pretty happy that I actually got to resolve Warp Worlds and I got to resolve, um, uh, the Great Aurora. So those were the cards that I really wanted to play with the deck and they work really well with the deck, especially Warp World. Uh, we got to see in game one, like with all the landfall stuff, if you can just build up a big board using, like, Avenger of Zenda cards and Faleth and all these things that make tokens when lands come into play. Even my commander, Omneth, makes tokens. We saw Titania doing it. Then you cast Warp World, and in theory, you're going to put, like, Lotus Cobras and Tireless Trackers in all those landfall things back into play. They're all going to trigger from all the landfall stuff. So I think that's the coolest thing that the deck can do. Otherwise, you don't really need that to win. That is, like, my main finish, uh, I guess, if I need, like, an actual finisher. But... A lot of the landfall stuff is just really good on its own. Like, you can make a bunch of scoot swarms or make a bunch of tokens with your commander, and Omnath offers a lot of protection because if your opponent wraths the board, which we kind of saw in the last game, like, you were in a position where you could have wrathed the board, but you got to get rid of Omnath first or else you take a bunch of lightning bolts to the face and probably die. So, uh, it's really powerful. I think the Great Aurora Warp World plan is a, a fun way to play the deck. I think it's like a, a fun finish for the deck. I think the new landfall cards are really good. We didn't get to see, uh, like Morag, but that would have been insane. Can you imagine that coming in off the Warp World and getting like 20 extra combat steps with everything having haste? Like there's just some really big explosive things that the deck can do, which I think are pretty fun. It, it's definitely really powerful the only downside is like it is an omnath deck you are playing a ton of land ramps so it's maybe not the spiciest deck you just kind of like play everything that tutors lands on the battlefield mm -hmm. and play everything that gives you extra land drops and play everything that says landfall on it and you have a really powerful omnath deck so mm -hmm. it kind of builds itself to some extent but i thought it was really fun to play yeah it does build itself but if you don't really care about having like the most unique deck on the battlefield uh it just kind of that kind of is a benefit, right? Like you're you need to have ramp in your deck. And this is a deck that rewards you for ramping, which is something you wanted to do anyway, which is kind of kind of like kind of just an inherently powerful shell. And then, yeah, Gruel, Gruel Omnath definitely has that added, added kicker where it's like, yeah, you need to wipe the board or else Omnath's going to win. But if you wipe the board, the Omnath player is just going to kill you, right? Because all those lightning bolts are going to hit you in the face. So I, I have much respect for, for Gruul Omnath, for sure. All right, Krim, we didn't get to see your deck entirely like... You didn't, you didn't get the win, but you did get to have some spicy turns with Risen Reef, with your Omnath Commander, and with Nyssa. So what else was like particularly spicy about Elemental Tribal? Uh, it, it was really just an Elemental, like kind of like aggro-ish deck other than that, right? I mean... I was, like, most of my elementals come from, like, you know, things that's, like, you know, like, the Phylath, or, or I mean, not Phylath, the, the Avenger of Zendikar, but yeah, like, my finishers were really just, um, uh, Finale of Devastation, uh, Triumph of the Hordes, and just stuff like that, so that's why I, I value my board more than I did, like, my Singleton Nissa. I just didn't expect Seth to have that many bodies, <laughs> <laughs> uh and, and and whatnot so like it, it is just all about playing a bunch of just elementals and then also there's like sylvan awakening plus triumph of the hordes stuff like that <laughs> triumph of the hordes of course of course of course yes yes you, you gotta dragons. get it with the infect yeah. and like I, I guess the big thing here is uh a, another key card that makes the deck tick is zendikar's royal uh that that enchantment is huge from jumpstart or Origins. I think it got reprinted in Jumpstart. Uh, but yeah, like that card, it's whenever a land enters the battlefield, I get a 2-2 Elemental. And that that card is big time for this deck. Yeah, I, on my stream, I had Risen Reef and Zendikar's Royal on the battlefield at the same time. So it'd be like a land entered, like uh, Risen Reef would trigger. A land would go from the top of my library onto the battlefield, which would trigger the Royal, which would make an Elemental token, which would trigger the Risen Reef. Which would yep. get a lane off the top of my library. I think the highest chain I got was like six in a row. And it was just like absolute, absolute madness. Absolute madness. Yeah. 
Correct. And I, and I, I feel like, like, like in a maybe like the, the power level of this deck isn't ridiculously high, but I would say that, you know, in a more of a medium power level, I guess you could like kind of like because of that interaction right there, you can kind of win games pretty quick. Mm-hmm. It's, it's definitely sweet. I can I can confirm. All right, Richard, we got to see mono green. You uh, you were mentioning at the beginning that it was like, ah, oh, it's mono green. I don't have a lot of answers. Blah, 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 eclipsed by the four color. And then you pull out the Helix Pinnacle win, which is, by the way, just props uh, for managing to generate that much mana. But did you have any other like ulterior win conditions or was that like the goal all along? Nope. There's two win conditions. Uh, Rogue's Passage and Helix Pinnacle. <laughs> and I, I was alive. I, I have no interaction. Uh, I ran out of cards. I like ramped all the way up, ran out of cards. But uh, Seth's... The great Aurora. Uh, Aurora, <laughs> like, basically fixed it all for me, right? He refilled my hand and uh, took care of the board. And then I I lucked my way back into an Omnath, and then I was able to go off. But the rest of my deck is just mana doublers. Uh, you saw most of the mana doublers I played that last turn. And then, like, untappers, like Wilderness Wreck, Seedborn Muse, uh, stuff like that. And I was actually going to Helix Pinnacle, like, the quote-unquote fairway, where, like, maybe every turn we add 10, 20 counters. <laughs> uh, but I was able to just add a hundred and one shot there with the oh, what's that new card? The Unbound Flourishing. Yeah, that from, was sick. Like new. It's like a year old, but uh, it's yeah, it, it like doubles anything with X in it, so you could uh, make double the progress. And then with uh, the doubling cube and the Unbound Flourishing, like you can just get there real quick. Uh, I'm not sure why Omnath died. That was I, I think Moto. <laughs> I think that was, I think that was just awkward. a Moto bug. Yeah, it had to be. I think Moto didn't realize it was. Yeah, it seemed like yeah. when you use the Dublin Cube, that's when Omnath like immediately like shrunk. So I think it was some interaction between Omnath and the Dublin Cube that didn't work out. Yeah, well. it sh- I'm pretty sure it should work correctly. I'm like, I don't know if we're like reading some of the not? cards wrong. <laughs> or, it doesn't you know, tag but... those green mana sources as the same as regular. I don't know. It's weird. Yeah, it's weird. But uh, it's fine. <laughs> and then, yeah, I had yeah, a lot okay. of cards that drew cards based on. My, you know the greatest power there that's why i like drew half my deck yeah um so yeah that that was it yep it looked sick it looked sick all right well that was omnath bowl everyone uh we saw that the green is actually the greatest uh omnath but not just the <laughs> yeah, greatest you guys omnath. watered your decks down by adding different colors pure green and i think we all learned a valuable lesson that green is overpowered in general in commander so yay weird <laughs> Awesome. <laughs> cool. So, yeah, hope everybody enjoyed that. Next week, we've got... Oh, oh, next week, we've got something very spicy. We're doing a budget week, and we have an interesting restriction. Uh, we'll tell you more about it next week, but it's going to be ultra budget. Uh, I think it's like... Uh, yeah, you know, we're going we're, we're gonna to keep it a secret. Yes, yeah. It's not because I can't recall it off the top <laughs> of my head. It's a secret. It's going to be super budget, so it's up my wheelhouse. So, uh going to be very fun and until next time friends see ya thanks for watching the video if you liked it help us out by clicking that like button down below and to keep up with the latest and greatest click on the subscribe button and don't forget to hit that bell icon to get alerts whenever we have new videos and if you want to check out similar videos click on the links here and here